only three books per person. Now, I know we have an unusually large family, but I wanted to break that down in terms of just one person. I have a 17-year-old daughter named Madison, and she's a voracious reader. She read the entire Harry Potter series in under a week, so we all love to read and we enjoy coming to the library. She can only check out three books because of our large family. Her friend Mallory is also a 17-year-old homeschool girl, but she's the youngest in her family, so all of her siblings have moved away. So she lives with her mom and dad only, and she can check out 10 books because of the 30-book checkout limit. So I asked, can Madison get her own library card? Maybe we can check out some more books that way. And at first I was told, no, that's against library policy. And then um, I emailed Ms. Kincaid, and she said, yes, she can get her own library card, but that will reduce the number of books we can check out to 20 per household. So then, in that case, Madison would get two books to take home. We were hoping for more books. So Ms. Kincaid said, well, you can just make more trips to the library, which means to get 10 books, Madison has to come to the library four times. To get 10 books, Mallory has to come to the library one time. Now, I'm not here to make trouble. I'm not here asking for special treatment just for my family. What I want is equal, equal number of books for anyone who comes to the Hood County Public Library. I want my 17-year-old or 12 or 8 or whatever to be able to come to the library and get the same number of books that any 